Hello Year One. My friend Bob the Bear has asked me to read one of his very, very favourite stories that he's especially chosen for you. And he's brought along one of his little friends. And what's the name of your story, Bob? My best friend, Bob. Brian the guinea pig lived in a nice comfy cage in Pete's pet palace with his best friend, Bob. Brian had short shiny fur which he was very proud of. Bob had long tufty fur which he didn't really think about all that much. There's Bob and there's Brian. The two little guinea pigs spent their days doing what guinea pigs do best. Eating, sleeping and playing I Spy. Brian was terribly good at I Spy and almost always won with clever words like budgerigar and dog food. One day Brian and Bob were busy playing when a little boy walked into the shop. I spy with my little eye, said Bob, but before he could finish, the little boy reached into the cage and picked him up. I want this one, the boy said. I shall call him Bluffy. Brian watched as Bob was put into a cardboard box with holes in it. He just had time to wave goodbye and Bob was gone. Suddenly, the cage felt very big and very empty. Oh dear, sighed Brian. I shall miss Bob. And he trundled off to find a peanut to cheer himself up. But he didn't cheer up at all. In fact, every day Brian missed Bob more and more and more. And every day he felt more and more miserable. Can you do your saddest guinea pig face? Poor Brian. Then one day, Brian was sitting in his cage feeling very glum when he noticed an old man peering down at him. The man picked him up and smiled. He's just what I was looking for, he said, and he put Brian into a box. I wonder where Brian is going. At first, Brian was excited. Maybe there will be other guinea pigs in my new home, he said to himself. He began to whistle and he felt much more cheerful. But that evening, he found himself all alone, without so much as an earwig for company. Brian sighed. He wished he was back in Pete's pet palace, at least he could chat to the goldfish there. I wonder what's happened to my best friend Bob, whispered Brian. He's probably forgotten all about me by now. He wiped away a tear and curled up in the straw. The next morning, Brian hadn't even opened his eyes when he felt his box being lifted up. What's happening now, he grumbled, but he didn't really care. Things couldn't get much worse than they already were. He drifted back to sleep, dreaming of Pete's pet palace and even winning a peanut throwing competition with Bob. A little while later, Brian was woken by a buzz of excited voices outside his box. Oh, bother, he said crossly. Can't I at least have some peace and quiet? Then all of a sudden, the lid was lifted off and a bright light streamed into the box. Brian looked up to see a little boy smiling down at him. He sleepily wondered if he had seen the boy somewhere before. Do you think you've seen that boy somewhere before? Hmm, I wonder. 
the boy picked Brian up and gave him the biggest hug he'd ever had. Oh, thank you, Grandad, he said happily. He's just what I wanted. I should call him Snuffles. Do you think Brian looks particularly happy with his new name? Hmm, maybe not. The little boy put Brian into his new hutch. Brian stretched out and sniffed the air. That's funny, he said, and he sniffed the air again. As Brian watched, a pile of hay in the corner started to move. And all of a sudden... <gasps> what do you think is going to happen? <gasps> Brian! Bob! <gasps> Can you do your most excited guinea pig face? Brian was so excited to see Bob that he thought he might just burst with happiness. That evening, sitting together in their hutch playing I Spy, the two little guinea pigs had almost forgotten they had ever been apart. I spy with my little eye, said Bob, something beginning with P. But Brian was already fast asleep. the end. That's such a lovely story Bob, thank you for choosing it. And what is your little friend called? Brian. Brian and Bob. Perfect. Bob and I just wish to say to you keep safe, keep well and maybe we'll do another story sometime soon. Goodbye you one. <laughs>